Welcome to Ballopedia's Daily Brew, your nonpartisan and unbiased source for political news. Today is June 21st, 2024, and here are today's top stories. The 2024 U.S. elections in New York are seeing the fewest number of candidates since 2014, with 59 candidates running for the state's 26 districts. Additionally, all incumbents are seeking re-election, meaning there are no open seats for the first time in 10 years. In total, 398 major party candidates filed to run in the New York elections. All 150 state assembly seats and all 63 Senate seats are up for election. New York and two other states, Colorado and Utah, will hold primary elections on June 25th. Recent campaign finance reports show that Hakeem Jeffries, Elise Stefanik, Steve Scalise, Mike Johnson, and Jim Jordan are the top five incumbent fundraisers in the U.S. House for the 2024 election cycle. Collectively, these five incumbents have raised over $53 million, accounting for 7.42% of all money raised by House members seeking re-election. On the other end of the spectrum, Frederica Wilson, Joseph Burkeen, Al Green, Andy Ogles, and Scott de Charlet rank as the bottom five fundraisers among incumbents, having raised a combined total of $953,303. Did you know there are 52 state courts of last resort? While each state has one court of last resort, Oklahoma and Texas have two, one for civil appeals and one for criminal appeals. In most states, the court of last resort is also known as the state Supreme Court. However, in New York, the New York Court of Appeals is the state's highest court. The Supreme Court of the state of New York, which includes 62 courts for each county, is a lower court. Visit our website to learn more about state courts of last resort. Tune in each Friday for new facts and trivia. Subscribe for free to Ballotpedia's Daily Brew to get these stories and more details delivered to your inbox, or click the link in our bio to read online. Thank you.